all right guys welcome back to the channel and today we're going to be talking about the css changes inside the builder let's suppose you have to change some icons or these text so how we can replace this with the css like we have to override these text and we have to place some icon we want to override those icons so how we can do that so that thing we're gonna talk about in this video and let's get started so first of all we have to replace these d and t like desktop mobile and t application into the icon so what we're gonna do we're gonna get the icons whichever we have to use so i have already got those icon so you can see screen smartphone tab these three icons i have so these are the svg file and i just need to write a css for that so first we're gonna we're gonna replace some things inside our grapechess config so you can see the three buttons we have in a slide last time when we were writing this configuration so i just i'm just going to remove this label link from here label so in each and every config so i'm just going to remove this Okay, and let's uh, put this one so just into the middle of the screen, like over here. Okay, because this one is tablet, and now we're gonna put the class name over here. Class name equals to. So far, let's stop. Okay. So we're gonna copy it and paste it over here as well. So it's gonna be for tablet and control V and we're gonna be for mobile. Okay, now what we have to do, we need to we have the class names. Now we're gonna use these class names and we're gonna override the CSS for these desktop and same for far mobile for tablet. Same for far tablet and far mobile. Okay. So we have. Let me check the spellings is correct or not. Okay, so spellings spelling is correct. Now we're gonna be just adding the SVGs over here. So we're gonna type content URL inside that URL slash icon slash screen in dot svg now we're gonna be adding the tablet image over here content url icon slash tab and here content url and icon slash tab screen smartphone.svg okay so we have added as icon over here and we have already replaced the class name so let's say images are icons are loading or not so you can see the icon started coming over here so currently the color of these icons are blue but we can change the icon color into the white as well like we can replace the icon color or we can change it directly into the svg as well so currently you can see over here so icon color is like this one so i'm just going to put fff over here if you know about little bit svg so you can understand this thing otherwise nobody you can read the documentation of svg so let's just replace the path fill FFF and let's see the color is getting white enough so you can see our icons are loading so same thing we can do for everything like these icons are coming or this text is we can add some icons into this one as well and we can add the icon replace this icon as well so anywhere into this uh, web page builder we can change anything according to ourselves so we can override the css according to our implementation whatever we want so we can also change these icon as well if you want you can add some extra i have already created the video on that like you can add some extra toolbar into this so how we can do that so this is that's it from this video and i'm just going to start new another series on this web page, grapechase web page builder because a lot of comment i got in the last few months and they have told like uh, can you create the grapechase implementation on the javascript only so there would be no any kind of react json all uh, whatever the code we will write it gonna be 
totally from scratch into the javascript and we will make the we'll go a little bit deeper into that and we will write some code like uh, add component add type and how we can implement the type so everything we're gonna do into the deeper and gonna be full fresh tutorials keep in touch and so till that tata bye bye take care and we'll meet you in the next video